Hey everyone, this is Rob Stuff from Off Topic Gaming. Today I'm showing you how to install Mac OS X Line on a USB flash drive or SD card. Alright, first thing you want to do is go to Mac Apple Store and download Line, of course. And once you download Line, you want to go into Applications. You feel it? And get them lying out. So I already did that part of it. Went in and found lines. You can search for it, you can find it. And I, I put in another folder on my desktop. Which is this folder here. I'm set the cone. All right. Next thing you want to do, you want to go to utilities. And open up this utilities. Now by the time you should install your SD card, which is right here. Now the next step is if it's a brand new SD card, you want to get it. Put the Mac OS Extended Journal and leave that and press erase and let it let it format itself to the Mac operating system. Now while now while it's doing that, come over here and right click on Mac OS in line, show package content, content. Okay, I don't know if you can see. You want to share support, and this is all you're looking for. Install ESD. I'm we'll drag that over here. Now I'm going to go to restore. I'm take this off. Drag that over. And this entire port is very important. Make sure you take untitled and put it into destination. You're going to erase untitled and copy and install. So this is my source. You're going to erase the untitled port and bring it over. You then you'll hit restore, pre erase, type in your password, and voila. It'll take a couple of minutes. But when I said hour and 11 minutes, wow, I don't think it'll take that long. But I'm going to just pop out the video and come back when it's finished. All right, guys, I'm back. The process took about roughly 22 minutes to finish, not an hour or something, as previously stated. But it right, was pretty easy and simple. What a title was, now we have Mac OS 10 install ESD. And pretty much, um, you, you put in your USB flash drive or the SD card. And when you put it in, you're going to basically you're gonna hold down option button when you hold on the option button you're going to get the option a screen will pop up let you install fresh install or whatever so i'm going to show you that video on the way out so i'd like to thank everyone who watched the video like subscribe comment and this is rob so signing out y'all peace